foodies will tell you, to truly know a place, you've got to enjoy the local cuisine. And now, the recipes for traditional favorites, popular local delicacies, and exotic gourmet creations can travel with you in Belize's first locally produced hardcover cookbook. Well, we said we're just gonna do a little cookbook. We took it the whole nine yards and we did, um, we tried to go above and beyond to make the book as special as it could be for Belize and about Belize. Well, as you know, we used to have Romax Supermarket and Romax started a cooking show during the holidays that used to continue through the year and it was called the Romax Cookhouse. And it's from that that we really got our first set of recipes. Now, a lot of them were changed and a lot of them have evolved from that first listing. To bring the recipes to life, McNabb and a crew of professional photographers invaded kitchens across the country. The cookbook represents history, it represents culture, um, exotic cuisine, and everything that surrounds that. We hope that it will put Belize on the map to a certain extent, and we hope that it will, um, it will encourage some food tourism for Belize, as well as, you know, raising the bar and, and trying to have a product out there that is of a world-class standard. We intend to sell the book in the United States, and so we wanted to be able to compete with other books of similar nature. Flavors of Belize is all about food, but it's not just a cookbook. It also includes snapshots of the country's stunning landscape. I mean, a lot of people travel just for, you know, a beach or an experience like that. But I think the smart travelers now, because of the internet, they can access all the photos and everything through that way. But to really travel smartly, it's by being conscious of what you're eating there. I think a lot of people now really look to food as the true, uh, a true way to experience the culture. A book like this could be an important tool for us when even when we go on our international visits to show off to our travel agents and our wholesalers and even our consumers an added value to visiting Belize and that is experiencing our culture through our food. Flavors of Belize the Cookbook was officially launched this week in Belize City at the Belize Biltmore Plaza. I'm making mango shrimp ceviche and coconut curry shrimp. The coconut curry is it's an original recipe of mine and it all has to do with with the background of being an islander and using a lot of coconut. We're basically doing like a Caribbean fusion with uh, some American cuisine. So it's like American Caribbean fusion is what we call it. And we're also coming up with new uh, dishes every so often that we try to use local indigenous ingredients and, and make them really creative and, and, and serve them in different ways. Well, Belize is blessed with so many beautiful ingredients. We have the fish and lobster and shrimp directly from the ocean. We have our herbs growing in the jungle. We have beautiful vegetables growing everywhere. And we have beef, which is excellent now. We have pork. I mean, all the basic products are available, plus much more, and that makes it a very nice place to work. I tried the tuna ceviche. It was great. Reminds me of real Belizean style, except that we normally use conch ceviche. So I, when I tried the tuna ceviche, I thought, wow, it was a little different, but still, ceviche is ceviche for me. I love it. I tried various dishes. Uh, I particularly like the pan-fried snapper. That was good. That was good. I'll see if I can go back and get some, some more. I love cooking. I think probably for me it's using the Belizean ingredients, using everything that is homegrown here, that you don't have to rely on imported products that you can get. I have mango trees in my yard. I can pick them and I can cook with them. As of recently, I've been doubling around in the kitchen and Belizean cuisine has always been an interest of mine and most certainly I'd buy this book. Um, just tasting some of the flavors that are here, um, they, they bring me back home. I get so inspired by new uses for ingredients every time I travel, especially what we're doing here, like to be able to really immerse myself in the, in the culture here and try all the different foods and then to have a cookbook to go home with is like totally ideal. I just, um, I wish I had a cookbook for every country I visited, but I, I'm so excited to go home and, and put my own spin on what I've been trying here. Right now we have launched the book only in country, 
um, because we do want this to be a book that Belizeans are proud of, but at the same time, it is our hope that we um, that the book is shared across the world, that it's not just something that's kept at home, and it's not just for somebody who's a Belizean or a Belizean living abroad, that it is somebody, anybody who loves food and great food, they should be able to enjoy our book. Flavors of Belize, the cookbook, is now available from local retailers or via the website flavorsofbelize.com.